Actually, I should tell you what event it is. It's so beautiful. We've had a change of plans up in here. Like, you have to go to like a club. <laughs> What was the best part? Hello you guys, welcome to day four of Vlogmas. I've just done my workout, which was brutal. 400 meter run, 20 wall balls, two rope climbs, and 10 lunges to squats with dumbbells. Oh, horrid. Hard. but I didn't run I decided to row which actually I think if I can get away with it I'll try and row every time because I just realized running it's I'm just not a run it, it, it's it's the worst thing it's punishment for me it feels like punishment um, and then I didn't do two rope climbs I did one rope climb each time and I went light with the dumbbells and now I'm having my protein smoothie from juice move um, but this morning I'm headed to first village market to try and get one more uh, although now that I think about it should I I think I will I think I will one more chocolate advent calendar um, and then I want to rush to two rivers because I want to make the most of the sales that they usually have um, specifically Nike I want to try and grab myself a new pair of sneakers this is my thing like I do this once a year during the sales Black Friday I go and buy myself the cheapest pair of sneakers I could buy really that's it like the cheapest pair and I'm good um, and then I have to rush back to the house and get ready because I have an event later this evening that I will bring you for um, but for now cheers mm, it's so good the one I'm having is choco moo it's got chocolate cashew milk banana dates and strawberries and also uh, protein powder vegan and in the chocolate flavor so it's actually really tasty um, I've also had so many mishaps this morning I forgot to carry I forgot to carry <laughs> shoes or sandals so I've got my slippers on today because I took a shower here and then my deodorant ran out and I didn't realize it but because of its formula there was like liquid in it and I was putting it on after I had my shirt on and now I have this weird stain on my shirt in two places it's just it's just messy today today is a bit messy but it's okay it's fine I'm just excited to go get my chocolate advent calendars because very soon I'll be able to start opening it oh, another thing I want to try and do is vlog the whole day and make this one vlog so I don't know if it'll be too short too boring or whatever but I just want to relax a little and try and film more bits without thinking too much about it because I think sometimes I'm like this isn't fun I should only vlog when I leave the house or something like that but and actually today is a fun day because I'm leaving the house quite a bit but I want to try and uh, just get the ball rolling so I, I have as much stuff up for you guys as I possibly can and what else oh today we today we will open the laptop I know um, on the last vlog I couldn't I, I, I can't tell you I just I hit a block and I really didn't open it I just placed it aside and I didn't even feel emotional I just I just took a step back from that and what did I do I read a little and then watched uh, some Netflix show and went to bed early um, but today we will open the laptop together for sure cheers okay I feel like I just won the lottery because I just picked the last one <laughs> The last one I can't I can't I can't believe it it's coming home with me it looks like they also added this and they've got lots of milky bar and the price on that one is good too it's about 900 shillings and then we've got like lint which I think is the most expensive one that they've got but like these they've got lots of them so that's great oh my god but they've got lots of other things too here like these little guys the chocolate Santas Kinder surprise. Are they surprised? Actually, yeah, they are. Okay. All right. I'm going to pay for this and then head out.
my gosh, oh my gosh. I'm uh, pooped, I really am. Finally home, uh, oh gosh, guys, guys, oh well, I'm not even saying anything, just thoughts are just all over the place right now. First of all, thank the good Lord that I was able to get the last Maltesers advent calendar because I, I genuinely think it'll be probably my favorite of all the ones that I've got, so whew, thank goodness I was able to get that. And then went to Miniso to grab a few things, went into Toy World to grab a few things, this is at Village Market, then rushed to Trivers because I foolishly, foolishly, and I want to kick myself, forgot that Nike have their sales starting from the 1st of November. The whole mall starts 1st of November. But in my head, Nike might have like okay sales, but Black Friday is when they were going to have like the best sales. So this whole time, I've been eyeing this day as the day when I was going to be like one of the first people in there and I was gonna get the best deals. Ho ho ho. Joke's on me. Joke's on me. Anyway, whatever I ended up getting was 50% off. I just feel like I could have gone earlier and gotten 65% off and paid even less because I literally live on one pair of shoes uh, for the gym for the year um, and luckily for I, and I think I know the reason but luckily this time around the pair that I bought last year in November at the same store at Two Rivers lasted pretty well I think the thing I've done differently is that I don't wash them every week I think I was overdoing it with that so these ones I'm okay if they look a little mucky and not you know tip top all the time and I just kind of rock them to the gym and that's really the only place I wear them and they've lasted a year and they're still okay so I feel like for the first time I'm going into you know another year of gymming with two pairs of shoes one is okay and another one is new and I'm just like what imagine imagine being that girl with multiple pair, pairs of uh, training shoes that just yeah <laughs> um and then I went into LCY Kiki because I wanted to get a few things. I also got something for myself, but I think I'll show you that later. Um, but it's a dress that I saw maybe a month and a half ago there. And I figured there's no way it's going to be. There's no way it's going to be there. And it, it was literally my last round. And I saw it just from the corner of my eye and I couldn't believe it. I'm going to show you. I'm not a big fan of the neckline, as you'll see, but... It's okay, it's the print, it's the drama, it's the fact that you can wear it easily in the house and you guys know if I can take something from the house to outdoors to running errands to a lunch date, going to see my fam, whatever, I love that, I love that. I'm quickly gonna try and get changed. I was actually in the middle of trying to take things off and I realized, wait a second, let me just catch you guys up on what my day's been like so far. Man. It's also very hot and as I was coming up my stairs I realized it was starting to rain <laughs> but it is now 106 and I hope to leave the house in exactly an hour let me show you what dress I want to wear for the event actually actually I should tell you what event it is but I'm going for a La Roche Posay event and I know the theme is around sunscreen and so what the you know the call I got yesterday was if you can try and wear like a summer dress something that like kind of screams beachy, just airy, relaxed type of thing. So I reckon, so I thought I could wear this dress because there's not a lot of places I feel like it would work perfectly. And I feel given how, I mean, is, can you, do you get more summery than something where your entire back is out? I don't know, I'm not sure, but I was thinking this, although it does require boob tape and I just, I'm feeling a little lazy about the idea of pushing up my babies. I figured something like this would be a good second option and I could wear it off shoulder. All of these would need a whole lot of ironing, obviously. Okay, those are our two options for now. Oh, I'm stuck at those two and I'm leaning towards the pink one because it's the easiest to wear and I don't have to worry about anything, but maybe I should make more of an effort and just wear the green one because I haven't officially worn it out. I only wore it for a shoot, but I haven't worn it out. And the pink dress, I've worn it a couple times now. So I think the decision has been made. We're going for green. <laughs> Oh my god, 
personal time? I'm sorry. <laughs> Jeez, that was most definitely an accident. But here I am in my look, my outfit. My dress is from Petal and Pop. I'll link the video below where I tried on a bunch of outfits from Petal and Pop and a few new in bits that I got a while back. Um, the back is just my favorite. It's so pretty. It's so pretty. Uh, I've taped up the ladies. This part used to really bug me. It doesn't bug me as much anymore. Like, I don't mind that there's you know, that extra fabric here. I could go and take it in, but I, I'm not that bothered. My hair, I just tried to finger comb it to try and get it looking. I don't, I don't know, look. Makeup is minimal. I don't even have any eyeshadow up here. I'm wearing Nancy Moise Shop New Levels. I think this shade is Scent Nudes, not uh, the other one that I usually gravitate towards. So Scent Nudes on my lips. I'm gonna have my Kyondo basket and I'm gonna have my, you guessed it, Equeta sandals, not these ones. These are from Miniso, which are actually so pretty as house slippers. So it's now 2.05 p.m. and I'm gonna start heading out because I'm also famished and I wanna try and make, <laughs> make it for lunch and try and get something to eat because I am hungry. I've only had that smoothie that I had this morning. All right, let's go. It's a little windy, so I hope you can hear me right, but um, guess who's here super early. <laughs> Me. Me, myself, and I. <laughs> Guys, it's okay though. At least I get to pick where I'd ideally like to sit. I don't know where I want to sit. I, actually, maybe I'm okay with here. Maybe I'll move a little bit closer that side. Hold up, I am on my way. I'm in motion. Let's go to the ocean. Yeah, let's go outside. We can hang out. Without freezing, yeah, isn't that amazing? In Christmas times, we'll be chilling and having a good, good time. I like how at this event, I'm out here showing you guys food. I'm not showing you guys product. I'm like, come on, let's scope what we're eating. There's fruits, tasty carbs, yes please, little parfaits. I wonder if that's yogurt, maybe some chocolate, I don't know. There's coffee and there's probably tea, yes we see tea. Hot milk, hot water, black coffee. That's Angel. That's me. That's her. Do I have? Oh, okay girl. I'm not going to touch these. <laughs> you really won't? Okay, not on camera. Okay. She didn't touch those. And then the most beautiful view that I didn't know we had. Like, I'm even trying to figure out, like, where are we? This is Lavington. Oh, gee. It's Lavington. Like, you kind of forget that we are a green city because when you're down there, you don't see all of this. You just see traffic and lots of people and just all of that. But look at that view. It's so beautiful. Struggle. My house looks like it's a million and one colors. I guess the light out there is really warm. And that one, I mean, this one is warm too, but I guess because of the green wall, it looks cool. Um, and I'm sat in front of the Christmas tree, but um, I went for the La Roche Posay event, and boy, were there some sunscreen myths that were busted for me. I thought I knew. Everything I needed to know about sunscreen. Clearly, there's a lot more to it than, uh, than, than I realized. I should start off by saying, sorry. I should start off by saying that I do work with La Roche-Posay and in fact, this is a painful partnership. Um, but I've been using their products for over a year and I freaking love them. In fact, oh my God, oh my God. I hope she comes soon. But my best friend, also started using La Roche-Posay last year when I went for their first Derm Live session. Mondi has eczema and she's spoken about it publicly and um, it's something that has plagued her for years and years. And it's one thing for me who, 
you know, just has the occasional spots here and there to talk about a product that I really love or a brand that I really love, that being La Roche-Posay, it's another for Mondi to go out of her way to text me and be like, yo, babe, the, what was it? No, um, oh, Lipica, the Lipica range, because um, they've got different ranges, like one is for sensitive skin, one is for uh, like sunscreen, one is for uh, like de acne, another one now is for like issues like eczema um, and that is now Lipica but she tried it because they gave me a whole bunch of products and I was like well I'm not gonna use this and I remember they said this is great for if you if, if you know if you've got eczema so I decided to give it to Mondi and she texted me like this product it's 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 completely changed the game it completely changed the game for her skin and at the time it was I wish she was here for, so that she could give you more details but at the time her skin was really acting up and flaring up but that really calmed everything down significantly um, and I believe since then she's bought a few more of their products I should have asked them to throw in a few more for Mondi maybe I'll just I'll just try and call and be like hey guys do you want to do you want to do you want to shout my best friend some early Christmas um, Lipica products but I truly believe in the brand and I think one of the things that wait I can't talk the battery's flashing and I just know any second now it's gonna let me just change that battery okay battery's changed what was I saying um oh I think I was trying to explain to you what what drew me to La Roche-Posay and that's well first of all they pride themselves as being science-based and dermatologically driven and because they take that so seriously that's the reason you won't necessarily find them at least as La Roche-Posay you won't necessarily find them in a lot of beauty stores so they want to be found at chemists you will have them at your dermatologist's uh, office so they'll probably uh, prescribe that to you because it there's backing there's science the ingredients and active ingredients are there in there in their products are going to do what the bottle says or, or what the um, ingredients or instructions say that they're going to do um, and so when I saw my best friend's reaction to that like that just sealed the deal some of my favorite products are I mean, I've said it so many times but the vitamin C I really also like the um, hyaluronic acid and it's got it's also got I think vitamin b5 what I wish like I, I just I just I'm just here to say I can't wait for them to start in, including some of the other products that I see like in other countries like I can't wait for them to be accessible here because I I just know I would trust them I would absolutely trust them and and especially if you've got sensitive skin that's another thing I noticed whenever I'd post something about La Roche-Posay I would get so many people whether it's in person or um, on in my DMs saying that this really worked for them for their babies I remember uh, seeing Patricia Bright talking about using La Roche-Posay on her daughter and if you follow her you'll know that her daughter has really bad eczema and they, she really really struggled with that so I trust this brand is what I'm saying um, another thing I like and actually I learned today during the derm class is that is their chemical sunscreens I didn't I didn't know the difference between a physical sunscreen and a chemical sunscreen and I won't break it down here but physical it like acts almost instantly and it's usually the one that will leave you with a white cast chemical penetrates and I'm not gonna get into it but this is why I love these because it doesn't leave you with the white cast and I don't know <laughs> my mom is the one and I actually just saw a comment that she left um, on my I might should just read it out to you she used to insist that we wear sunscreen when we were at the beach which is great you should wear sunscreen at the beach I'm the naughty one who would try and avoid it but um, the reason I, I, I dev this is what she said she left this comment I remember those days I think with my skin tone it wasn't just purple it was bluish purple you know what I'm talking you guys know what I'm talking about as dark-skinned girls you know it was a struggle trying to find good sunscreen back in the day so I have been using their sunscreens for a few years now um, and I think I first bought it at and even before like they approached me and we started working together and I was a La Roche-Posay partner I got it from the chemist at uh, what is it what is it called Roslyn Riviera um, and I distinctly remember I was going to Lamu and I just wanted something that would hopefully work really well and I didn't know much about the brand although I'd heard about it uh, 
few years before that from Susan Wong. Um, tried it, loved it, been using it on me, been using it on my little lady. They've got a kid's version too, in case you're wondering, on my little lady. Um, although from what the dermatologist said today, you can use either one on yourself or on your child. It's just that the kids one is obviously formulated to be a little bit more sensitive in case your child has sensitive skin. So yes, um, thermal water. This is, I think, what kind of got them going. Their thermal water, their spring, what does it say exactly? Thermal spring water for sensitive skin. I think this is what launched the brand. Um, and then the sunscreen that I have been using and loving for now, over a year i think i'm on my second bottle or is it third i, I, I can't remember i think it might be i don't want to say for sure i know for sure i've thrown away one bottle because i finished it i think i might be on my second uh yeah i think i might be on my second because i was using like a bunch of others at some point but yes this iconic and then their cicaplast which i'm so happy that they that they threw this in there because um they gave us little uh goodie bags after the event but Sikaplast is like think your homemade remedy for mosquito bites little wounds or scabs that you're trying to deal with uh, irritation skin irritation I was in where when was I I was in Diani with uh, Fatma Mutua that vlog that you'd have watched a few weeks ago um, and I tend to have the worst the worst heat rash whenever I'm at the beach. I think I even filmed some videos, so I will show, I'll in, I, that's what I'll do, I'll include them here, because I believe, if I still have them, assuming I didn't get rid of them, I will include them here, but I have the worst heat rash at my joints, so like armpits, elbows, um, neck, at the back of my knees, it's terrible. Um, and this is one of the things that really help, helped calm me down. I also used their I believe it's their Lipica uh, cream, shower cream, and their lotion on my body. But this is what I would concentrate on those areas, the Sikaplast. And I just, I love it. And I'm so happy I have a small one because honestly, the bigger one that they gave me broke a little because we really do use it all the time. And the lid broke. Um, so I'm just glad that we have a little one that we can use easily around the house. But just in case you want to try this brand, I will leave a link to um, my Dawa and Good Life Pharmacy. I don't know if Good Life Pharmacy have an online platform, but you can find them at any Good Life Pharmacy. And I, and I believe at this point there would be a few more pharmacies that have that carry them. Um, but my Dawa, you can try them, and my Dawa often have these great discounts. In fact, today, as I'm filming, they have 30% off. Oh, I wish you could take advantage of that because it would be ideal. I actually took advantage of it because I got something from my friend um, who's looking to get into skincare and I got her a few of these La Roche-Posay bits. So, ladies and gentlemen, that's why you should follow me on Instagram if you don't already. That's all I'm going to say. All right, I want to show you some of the other things I picked up today. Oh, oh, well, this is just sitting here, so we're just going to... Isn't it crazy that by the time you're watching this, I haven't opened this because, you know, it's not December for me. Or should I just make this my vlogging? That's what I, I think that's what I'll do. Oh my gosh. So this will be this one or the others? I think this one. I think this one. What day is this today? Is this day four? It's day four. It's day four, right? But we're going to make this my vlogging advent calendar because clearly i'm not you know like i need one for vlogging and then i need one i need ones for real life and the real life ones will open them and go according to the actual days in december this one we'll do together and i got the last piece day number four there we go ah! i feel like i'm cheating the system but you know what it's okay okay Oh, what is that? And how in the world am I supposed to... Oh, there we go. Oh, that's Santa. Can you see? You can't see. It just looks like a chocolate blob, but... Oops, you're shaking. Hmm. Oh. 
I mean, it's good, don't get me wrong. It's definitely good. But I did think that we would have, you know the Maltese's crunch? That's why I'm so excited for this one. But I guess if something is this flat, even I, what was I thinking? Of course, it, it wouldn't just be your regular Maltese's, but I feel like they could fit some, like mini Maltese's in there, because I really want that crunch. That's what I love about this chocolate. But yay, I'm so happy, now we know. This is gonna be one of my traditions now. I'll get an advent calendar for Vlogmas, for us, for you guys, for us to do this together. And then I'll be having my other ones that I do for real with my little fam. Okay, ooh, Elsie Waikiki, let me show you the dress that I got. The print is what sold me. And I think I may have, oh yeah, I did tell you, I told you a little bit about how I didn't like the neckline so much, but the print is what sold me. I just, look, oh, look at that banana leaf print. It's so beautiful, I love it. I can just see myself flowing through the house with such ease and I see myself leaving the house to run errands and um, it's just an easy dress that you don't have to think much about. I will obviously include cutaways of me wearing it so that you see what it looks like on me. I would most, like I didn't, I didn't try it on with a belt when I was at Elsie Waikiki, obviously because I didn't have a belt then, but um, I'm not sure if I'll, I think I would prefer it with the belt, but I'm not entirely sure because if I'm in the house, I wouldn't belt up. I'd just let it be loose and, and all of that. But the neckline is what I wish they could have just done something with. I don't know what, but I feel like they could have just had a little bit more fun. But I don't mind too much. I am obsessed with the print. It's the kind of thing that I believe would photograph so beautifully. It's the kind of dress that you throw on and you don't have to think too much about. It's already like a statement and I like those. The ones that you don't have to think too much about, you don't have to worry about pairings because it's already just doing all the work. I can't see a tag here now, but I think it was about 3,000 shillings. And then, when I was leaving CrossFit earlier this morning, I, um, met a subscriber which is always so it's always so lovely to meet one of you guys and if you ever see me out and about please come say hi um and she was so kind enough to offer me some bits from her little like store it's like a little kiosk but not your traditional kiosk like you're thinking but like a nice beautiful like bamboo wooden themed uh space that's right next to crossfit and they sell a bunch of things in there. Some of them are like teas and uh, little bites and snacks, and then others are bamboo products. And she so kindly gifted me her tea, and this is the Aroma Tea in Umi. It's got cinnamon, cardamom, and passion fruit. Ooh, oh my gosh. I will link them down below for you guys. Tea is always a good idea, I agree. Lisa, I think her name was Lisa. Was her name Lisa? I think it was Lisa. She also gave me um, a couple of toothbrushes. Both of these are bamboo. One is kids, and I just wanted to show you. I should have asked for the prices as well, but we've got rainbow colored uh, bristles. This is soft. What would the correct term be? I'm not entirely sure, but it's soft right because you know how sometimes you've got like the harder the harder bristles i don't do too well with that my gums don't agree with that so um she also had the soft option which is great what is the brand eco smiles is the brand and then i got myself the black version i love these i mean you guys know that this is one of the ways that I try and minimize waste in my house. Toothbrushes, because you're supposed to change your toothbrushes every three months, right? Why do I suddenly, it's like I can't remember what that, I think it's three months, I think it's three months, not two months, I think it's three months. Um, so you're supposed to change your toothbrushes every three months. I find, especially with kids, you almost want to change them every month because I don't know what's happening in there, but for some reason, bristles are facing left and right. It's like they're, it, something happens in kids' mouths. I don't know, you tell me. But for adults, I think it's every three months. And if this is something that you can reduce the amount of plastic that you're using, I think it's so easy because truth of the matter is the toothbrush that you used when you were, I don't know, 10, 20 years ago, is still somewhere, like it's not, decomposed and like in 
like turned into earth it's still somewhere on this earth and those are a lot of toothbrushes a lot of toothbrushes and then whilst i was there i noticed something and i i um loved so much so i bought this but um eco smiles also have these bamboo bristle brushes paddle brushes paddle brush i think this is a paddle brush how cute is that i'm obs i'm genuinely obsessed i mean on the screen i have to say it's definitely coming out a lot more yellow in tone than it is in person and it's because of my christmas tree behind you but i think this would also be like an easy thing to throw into someone's uh gift present gift thing box gift bag if you are gifting like you can tell that's part of the things that's Part of what I was doing today was also buying gifts because we have this thing happening very soon and there's going to be some gifts um, being exchanged. So I just, I just loved this and I thought it would be so nice. Like if you were trying to get someone like a little hair starter pack or kit. Um, and I say that because one year for my sister's birthday, that's what I got her when she went natural. I just decided to like get her the like everything that you could possibly well maybe not everything you possibly need <laughs> but everything that my budget could allow um and i feel like this would have been a nice thing to add oh my god i haven't used a, br a, a paddle brush in so long i love this i wonder how it will wear over time like i hope it'll still remain clean um especially with product but it was only 600 shillings and i feel like that is such a steal okay now for my shoes oh i did film what shoe what pair i went i left with i'm for, I'm, i clearly there's it's been a long day and there's just so much content i'm like filming or posting on social media that i forget what i shared where but i do remember that i showed you guys as it was being packed what i ended up with but you know we're just gonna pretend and we'll open it up again i also did a poll on instagram and surprisingly most people predicted that this is the pair that i would have picked up maybe it's not so surprisingly <laughs> maybe i'm not as mysterious as i think i am and i'm actually quite predictable which i'm okay with but i went for oh in this light they look they look white actually but I would say they've got like a bluish undertone. They're definitely more gray than they are white. I did have a pair that looked almost like this um, a couple years back, but I wore them to death and they started to fall apart. And so I replaced them with my other ones that are pink. And I just, what I do wish though, is I wish I had a little bit more color when it came to my workout gear. But I do think that these are going to be the easiest to pair. Like if I'm traveling um, in long distances, like this is probably what I'm gonna wear. Like on a flight, this would be perfect. So I don't mind that they are this simple gray color. I think in total it was about 7,500 shillings. When I got there, a lot of the shoes that are discounted by you know 65% off which for the last two years that's what I've gone for I've just gone for what is the cheapest shoe that you can give me that's either for running or training that's just that's it <laughs> most of the ones that I wanted that were in no they didn't have any in a size 6 that were 65% off they didn't have any that were 65% off so I got these that were 50% off and it's a deal but you know all right now we have one more item to unbox and I think you know what it is because I pressed pause on that yesterday and I, I can't even explain how it's still here and it's not even been opened. It doesn't, it doesn't make any sense. It doesn't make any sense, but we're going to do it. All right, here we are. I feel like everything looks very green. <laughs> my dress, that wall, the tree, my glass. I clearly, clearly have a thing for green. I mean, I already knew that, but it just feels even more evident right in this moment here we are again second time's a charm uh i just want to show you what my current laptop situation what we're what where we're at okay i'm going to as soon as i figured this out which hopefully i'll i'll be able to do tomorrow i'm going to take this to someone to try and fix how bad is that i mean i wasn't exaggerating right guys it looks like i don't know how I don't know how we're still running. I do not know. So as I was telling you in the last video, when I open it up like this, this part just kind of touches the 
the actual glass table rather than just sitting off of the hinges here. I don't know if it's something that can be fixed, but maybe they can use the parts separately. I'm not entirely sure, but we'll see. I've not been the best uh, keeper, but I hope to be better with this. Clearly, you can see I didn't even have any kind of protective covering for it, but that's one of the things that I wanna buy for this, and I'm gonna start looking at some cute options, but I want to deck it out properly. I want to have a nice uh, slip for it. I want possibly to maybe have something for the keypads. I don't, a keypad rather, I don't know. And I might even get something, like I, not I might, I will also get a laptop cover. Like, not a, not a cover, but like a case, you know? A nice little case, so that as I put it in my bag, or Hyundai or whatever, it's just, it's extra safe. Okay, enough talking, here goes. Also, I got, I got, um, I think this is space gray versus my old one, which is that, do they look the same? Are they the same? They're definitely not the same. <laughs> For a second I was like, why, why does it look like I'm lying? Why does it look like I'm lying? But I chose a, a different color. <laughs> look at her, oh my God, she's so much smaller than my other one, she's tiny. Oh my, how did, how do people do it with this small, that, oh my gosh, like, she, look at that, like, yo, I feel like I was really balling with my 15 inch. Oh, the charger is very different from what I currently use. something here that says touch ID Ooh. I almost don't want to peel it off I almost almost don't want to peel it off but here goes oh my god she's so beautiful and you can definitely tell that the colors are different now that We've got the sleeve off. Whoop, jeez. You can't tell in this light. You can't tell. It looks like I'm lying to you. They look exactly the same. They look exactly the same, at least on the screen. I don't know if I'm editing, they'll look different, but they look exactly the same. Oh my God, it's so light. I all, like you can, this is tiny. It's even got a cover. To use English as the main language, press the return key. Okay, I'm 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 gonna I'm gonna focus on how is it fully do they come fully charged? This thing is that it's like it's fully charged. I I don't remember them coming like that. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna it's also not that small. I thought like the screen would be tiny given just, it just looks so much smaller, but I could easily, easily work on here. I mean, ideally, wouldn't it be so nice to have like a bigger screen and, and especially with all the editing that I hope to do in the next couple of years, like I, I would love that. And so maybe that could be like a goal, you know, like to have a little office, a, a space, Maybe not in the, I don't know where, maybe, I don't know where, but it would be nice. It would be nice and that could be a dream. But in the meantime, this isn't as small as I thought it, as I thought it was. Like it just felt really tiny. I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, I'm going to set this up. I'll probably pick up the camera once Moan D gets here, but um, I'm just going to, I'm, I'm, I'm going to have a moment with my, with my new lady. I think that's Moan D. I'm 
vlogging in case you don't want to be, Definitely. but you don't. No. <laughs> Monty opened, opened the door. When I opened the door, she was like, "Hun, I know I look like the ghetto, but you know, we just keep moving." Because she was undoing. Her, no, because she was undoing her braids. Hun, I've looked worse. Yeah, just drop it, hun. Just drop, drop the mirror. Drop Sorry. the mirror. I'm kidding. Just, but I've looked worse on my. Listen. Okay, no, I get it. I get it. Don't, 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 don't worry. Strong note for me. Yeah. Oh my god, it's even like, it's, it's already, I guess it already knows my favorites because I've synced in everything on iCloud. Jeez, this like, honestly, technology is amazing. I've just opened it, it came yesterday, and I've just been setting it up. Oh, I was like, are you talking? No, 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 I was talking to you now. I was talking to you. That's amazing. I'm so happy. I don't know. I just feel like it's so awesome. <laughs> it's so exciting. I know. Oh, that's so exciting. Thank you, honey. So, so exciting. <laughs> oh, I'm tired. I can imagine, honey. I even wanted to say, like, bless you for doing everything. Oh, it's safe, passive. Sorry, I'm coming. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Um. Oh, no, I'm even. I'm just more tired mentally than physically. Oh no. But I was just like, bless you for coming out after like all your errands oh, and after so all, like a long work day. It's so I know you guys. Sure. We've had a change of plans up in here. So I thought for for a sec. I thought we'd spend the evening. Oh, my dress is just doing the most. I thought we'd spend the evening watching King Richard, which I downloaded for us. Mondi has a glass of wine, some sweet red wine, and we were just gonna just take it easy. Do you know what she's just suggested? We're going out! <laughs> I haven't gone out in years! Yeah. And for whatever reason, like I everything. Feel like the last time we went out was the time when we went to Jay's. Oh yeah, we don't go to Jay's anymore. Well, anyway, it's not even. Um, yeah. Yeah, we but don't. That was a while ago. Actually. That was a long Wasn't time ago. Wasn't it the day for the Beyonce? It was the Beyonce thing. thing. I even referenced. Did I reference it somewhere? I can't. It was I, the yeah, I, I remember thing. talking somewhere. I don't know where about how that was the last night. Like yeah. the Beyonce thing was a yeah. big thing. Yeah. And I remember not even caring that the music was loud because I'm really a good neighbor. Most times, like we're quiet. Yeah. There's no like it's jump. Like ice. yeah. It's quite good yeah. that night i was like all right guys this is the one time in every four years where i get a pass okay <laughs> and then afterwards we went to jay's and it was so it was so good nice it was actually really good that um good. but we're not good we don't we like after like i we just said we don't jay's. support yeah <laughs> we, i just knew even before it it shut down i just was like this after all the stories i'd heard i was like no mm. this is not where my money or enjoyment will be will be had I have no idea where anyone goes. I have no idea. So the last time I went, and even just now, I was like, should I have a drink? Because literally the last time I had a drink was in New York 2019 with Patricia. That whole trip, I had a few drinks. Like there yeah. were a few times we had drinks. But the one time, yo, the one time, the one time where I went extra, we still talk about it, hon. Like it's so bad. Did I tell you? I might not include yeah, this part yeah. because it's just yeah, like brutal. Yeah. Mm. You know what I forgot? What? Oh, come on. I have a charger. Yeah? That, that, that tiny one would fit yours. No? Of all the things. Of all the things. Would I have I a charger? What, charger? what kind of charger? What, which one does, Let me try another one. That? No, no, no. I've also got my Phantom. Oh, X. that yeah, one will charge Okay, perfect. Sure. Let me get that. Okay. okay. I'm trying to figure out what to wear. So, Mondi has jeans, bodysuit, boots, yeah. which sounds perfect. Mm. Or I'll probably wear another top. Actually, I'm not gonna wear my bodysuit. It's tight, and I'm feeling like I need to not. Even, I wish I could go naked, but I can't. <laughs> we're not doing that. Yeah, <laughs> it's not the city. It's not. Um, I have no idea, Han. You should have seen me like a few. Well, not a few minutes ago. Like an hour ago, I was yeah. showing like, oh, these are the things I got. And one of them is this like lounge dress let me tell you my wardrobe does not have it's anything for, yes yes it, there's nothing about no, it does the top i got you is perfect for tonight the black okay, one. okay. yeah with that's jeans. perfect with jeans done that's and? it and heels like your wedges well wear your flats then or even <laughs> boots let's just be twinsies and keep I'm, it moving i don't have boots that are comfortable 
oh you can wear it with even if you wear it with sneakers hon it's okay like Nairobi is just not the place to be dressing up I don't want to dress up but Good. I want to look like I I'm I know where, where I am I want people to be like this one doesn't look this one looks like it's it's, out, out of yeah, place exactly. a little bit out of place I need hair yeah um, which I also don't mind so much but I also don't want to like be no, a, sticking out like those, a sore like, thumb the wedges did Amani bring them back? No, oh, those are Amani board. The last time Mondi perfect. was here, Ama Amani yeah, board the, the shoes that yeah. Mondi gave me. Han. Okay, we'll find the shoes. Don't worry. Okay. Yeah, you can oh. even wear my boots, and then no. I can wear. No, I'm not joking because I have other sandals. No, in fact, you can wear, wear sandals. my sandals. Like they, they have a heel. That's what I'm saying. Oh. Wear those, in fact. Wear those, then I'll wear the boots. They have a very small, like it's so tiny. Okay, we'll see. It's like a kitten heel. Okay. Yeah, and it's very we'll comfortable. Okay, all right. Mm -hmm. Do you know what I've just thought? I'm not. I feel like this is typical person who doesn't go out. I was like, but I don't want mosquitoes to bite my toes if I'm in like I'm, my I shoes are out. I know. I just, but generally that's what came through my mind because right I'm like, oh, you're but killing mosquitoes. Me. You're finishing my toes. I soul. really don't go out. And then also before I turned on the camera, I just was like, I really feel like I should take a nap before because mm -hmm. I'm my, I'm the 9:30 p.m. and I'm in bed type of girl. Mm -hmm. So, but also I don't think it's gonna be a late night. No, no, I have to wake up for my cooking class. I can't can't afford for it to be a, a, a late night. These were the last words. The last word is the famous last word. No, words. please, because this I'm is the last one. No, tell no, me that, that chef is like Gordon Ramsay. Oh. He's literally like Gordon Ramsay. Like, really? Yes. He like in like don't like, mess yeah, up. Don't his mess up. Schedule. Like he's like sarcastic, yeah. but funny as yeah. well. Like I think everyone else in the class was like, what the fuck? going on here yeah because usually the other chefs are so chilled this guy's like hey mate my class starts at nine yeah he's literally. british yeah oh wow he's like yeah, yeah. 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 Ramsey, i'm telling you i was telling me this was me <laughs> when he was like yeah it's all test because i was the first time to walk in oh. so, and that's the first time i was so early yeah. i'm usually not that early I'm so yeah. proud of you. He's like, you didn't wash your hands? Did you wash your hands? Richard, did she wash her hands? Wow. I'm like, what? What am I? The yeah, first time I washed my hands, actually. I yeah, actually I did. did. No, I didn't. But Michael Buffett. Yeah. Are you Michael so Buffett? Buffett? Yeah. I should have asked him. Yeah. Why are you so Buffett? <laughs> oh, Mate. He should have thrown me out. <laughs> um, anyway. Okay, so we're going to press pause. Oh, no. We're still working. Wait. Yeah. No, I'm almost done. You're okay, almost I just done. Need to draft this stupid yeah. thing. And then we can eat done. something here, and yeah, then it would be a good idea yeah. because it's good to eat before you go. Do you think I'm gonna pause? Imagine if I was the vlogger out at night with my camera. That would be fun. But it would be no, fun. It, would not. it would not be it fun. Not. It's like I'd be kicked out. People don't want themselves vlogged. It depends. Like I feel like. I would feel very uncomfortable if someone would, was yeah, vlogging, like what, had a camera pointed. Yeah. I would be like, "Hi, Monty, this is not the place." But um, so obviously, I will not. If I do catch anything, it's gonna be on my phone. It's gonna be a fun night. I don't know. If, it, this is a moment where I don't know if I've vlogged long enough for it to be like a, its own vlog, vlog, or if I need to combine something mm. from tomorrow. But I would rather just. Maybe I should just talk about us in the morning. That's when I'll end it. I'll end it in the morning and then you'll know. What kind was of it a long night, night? Or was it, oh, we'll be back here in like two hours. Like, I have, this is, if this is it, I've not missed anything about yeah. the night. Now I feel so These much Nairobi pressure. Nights. But wait, like, do you want to go to like a club? <laughs> no. What's a club? A club is a club. This is like, shisha in the club. This shisha in, in the, the club? Yeah. But shisha is illegal. It's so <laughs> <laughs> Listen, this is the wrong person. Somebody, I need somebody else here. It's tough. It's no. tea for tough. Tea for tough. <laughs> but. I mean, we um, didn't mean shisha. Yeah. Oh, gosh. gosh. Obviously. Gosh. Anyway. But I did. <laughs> to go to a club or a club 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 first are we taking we're obviously taking taking ubers oh 100 okay so yeah no so 
So I think I want. First of all, do I want to drink? I don't want to drink. That's I really, fine. I don't want to deal with the hangover. I have so much I want to do, and I want to wake up and yeah. be like refreshed. So well, I'm, not I'm gonna also drink. not going to drink. No, you've got to drink. That much. Okay, okay, yeah. a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, well, all this is to say we'll catch you in the morning. Um, Mundi still has to undo her hair, which, by the way, looks cute, and like with the curls Man, and everything. This is so like it's six months of growth. Yeah. Wait, but not six months of what you had before. It's just six months of growth since you last texturized. Yes. I don't know why in my head I registered that as you've had that for six months. No. Whatever hairstyle yeah. you've had. I know, yeah. I know, I know, I know. <laughs> when Day was like notorious like, for <laughs> notorious, she would get braids and like within a week yeah. they're it's out. Like, Sorry, and I it would be this. like, but you just had mm. them done. Like, yeah. All right. Okay. We'll catch you in the morning and we'll tell you how tonight went. One day. It's tough. It's tough. It's tough. Good morning. Morning. I figured we could give like a quick rundown since we said we said we said we would say. We I did didn't say. say. Han, also, are you okay being in, in the camera? Like, yeah, okay, good, good, good. Okay, so how was last night? It was good. How was it for you? You know, I who did I text this morning? Mutua. Oh, and I was like, um, I'd be okay if I didn't go out for another three years. I really would. I really would. I just it's the loud music, it's um like so many people. I don't I really had not missed that yeah. at all. Like there's yeah. not any part of me. And Mondi was so at home. She's just like feeling herself and I was just like so much is happening so much is happening everywhere at the same time yeah and um I think if it was like I was thinking about it actually and if there was like a a place with music that wasn't so loud but you could have conversation too and it wasn't so crowded <laughs> I don't know I don't know. It's basically meet me at the cafe. <laughs> that's all. Yeah. Honestly, that's giving like, me yeah, art cafe. cafe. Yeah, it's, like just a little I bit of background just music. For <laughs> coffee Maybe tapas. Even tapas is too loud for you. Ma yeah, I don't know. Just coffee. Cool. Something like that. Cool. But you know what was the best part? Mm -hmm. The food. You guys. Oh, yeah. No one told she me that they had nachos. They were so <laughs> good. We went to two places. Yeah. Uh, the first one was like the popular place with all the cool kids, yeah. or however you want to call it. Yeah. And the second one was just like a straight up club, like yeah, you said. Club. And in the club, the nachos. They were I was so like, yummy. What is this? And do they, they serve really it during good. the day? It was so they good. Do, actually. Really? Mm -hmm. Oh. It was, it was so good, good. yeah. Good. So you know, see you in three years in the club, but I'll see you like next week we'll yeah, at my house next. for a sleepover. I'll see the club soon. Yeah, the, yeah, the club. Sure. Mondi will be there for very sure. soon. For me, someone needs to create something that so people like me feel comf like feel. I wish there was something like that because I wouldn't mind being out yeah. if it was just like tweaked in all these different things. And I'm sure there's many other people like me. Right? 100%. I'm just trying to think of where we yeah. take you. If that you know, like, right. like for instance, I, I don't know where, I, actually, I don't know where I would even suggest it as if <gasps> I would tell. Cafe. Really, that's what I was going to say. No, but I'm like, not even joking. Our cafe, but, like, but our cafe with point, like maybe a little like, bit more music yeah. and like a few more people and there's like movement so you yeah. can move from place yeah. to place. But our cafe, no one's getting out of their chair to like, no, you know. Not to dance. No, no. no. Definitely not. So, it feels like that is all yeah. I'm asking. Anyway, we're gonna say goodbye here and say goodbye <laughs> to Mondi. Yes, and thanks I'm for rushing. a good night, hun. Oh, that was, was that was fun. It was and it was so impromptu, good. but it was fun. Yeah, I think it was a good night. Yeah, I think yeah. so. Bye! <laughs>